This is going to be easy. He's probably going to take damage to dark power, isn't he? Because he's all holy and stuff. Even star. What's that with our fish and chips? Yeah, definitely vinegar on the chips. Oh no, curry sauce actually. Yeah. I've never tried tartar, but yeah. Vinegar or curry sauce. Delish. Look at that lizard. And Dan standing side by side. Salt, yeah, salt and vinegar. Gravy on the chips, that's boring. Have gravy on other stuff. Yeah, all of it. Stop it, I'm hungry. I already had steak and chips for dinner. You don't have to stop. It's fun talking about food. I guess. Are you going to do anything, mate? Apparently. Well, I didn't have time to defend. Absolute zero. No one had time to defend, apparently. Ow! I didn't realise that was anything. I thought it was just effects lingering. Thanks, AI. For swerving into it. Boys, are just me, or does he do different attacks when his aura changes colour? I reckon he does, you know. Knowing what type's coming up might help you choose a familiar. Oh, thanks. I didn't have time to read it. Why did that one specifically not have the like dialogue that I can progress on my own? It's all right. He's after it. I don't need to worry about watching his changing colour. I guess he's doing. I don't know now though. Wind, apparently. That's probably me. Oh, I don't have time. I also want some fish and chip shops. It's a bit sweeter. I guess it can. I guess it can vary. I thought that was 400 damage it just did. But, but where we get fish and chips from, it's real nice. Quick before Snake runs out of stamina. No, let Drakaya finish him. Yeah, tail whip. Take that, taste my ass. That's an offer to all of you as well, by the way. No! Unless you want to. Homemade mayo, even better. Freshly squeezed. Ugh. I can't believe a boss gives less experience than a toko whatever thing. 69. Excellent. As a Quake 3 person would say. It would appear that my ghost is no match for you. Your ghost? Uh, your ghost? Doodle Doo is not alive anymore. Oh. Yeah, because we just killed him. Doodle Doo is a wand. I hope it's not actually called Doodle Doo. I don't want to use a wand called that. A wand? You mean that wand? Indeed. I am a soul. I thought you were a ghost. The soul that resides within the wand known as Astra. There you go, that's a better name. Where the hell did Doodle Doo come from? I've never had mushy peas, I'm curious. Actually, I might have. Got a vague memory of having it when I was a kid. But not recently enough for me to know what it tasted like. But that would be interesting to try. I like peas. I'm just catching shark fog, the ultimate weapon as it's scrolling off. I don't remember that quote, but I like it. Ugh, let me just tab out quick. Um, no, I did read everything, that's fine. I've got to catch every little bit about fish and chips because it's important. I never tried pickled egg, that would be nice. I tried pickled onion, but no. I don't want that. A soul inside a wand. I suppose this wand is something like Mornstar then. That is correct. Astra is Mornstar's twin. I gave you Mornstar that you might find your way to me. The child likewise. What do you mean likewise? 
The Queen banished P to your world, Oliver. I had her meet you there, to show you the gateway to ours. Mm. She gave you a wand made from a branch of the Nazcan Sky Tree. How is that in my world? Thus granting you its considerable power. I want to help you, but first prove how good you are here. It's, it's a bit silly. How about I just prove it by going and beating them instead? A wand made from the sky tree? You mean that stick I found? Yes, he <laughs> he, Doodle Doo gave it to me. Super honourable evil man. Yeah, I don't think this guy is evil at least. I don't really know what the deal is with these guys. They seem good and bad. P led you to this world, and she has continued to lead you all the way here. Well, I haven't been doing what she's been telling me. I've been following the stars on the minimap. But why are you doing this? Do you not serve the White Witch? Are you not a member of her council? Ha, huh, I work for no one. This mask, this gallus, is a necessary pretense, nothing more. It enabled me to get close to her, to watch over her. To protect my daughter. Ah. Huh. Well, that explains why he's on our side then, I guess. Your daughter? You mean the White Witch is... Blimey, you're Cassiopeia's father? After my passing, Cassiopeia lost her way. She called down the manor with the best of intentions. And despair was her reward. It was only then that she became the White Witch as you know her now. Now my beloved daughter cannot see for the darkness that engulfs her. She is lost and alone in a world of her own making. She made this. Massive. Her own world? It pains me that it should have to come to this. I had hoped I might make her see the error of her ways, but it proved too great a task for a mere spirit. Now you're a spirit. You've been a ghost, a soul, and a spirit. He just wants to be everything. Doodle dip. Uh, chickpeas. I've never tried those either. I always hear they're nice. They do them in tins at the local shop. I should probably try them sometime. I tried broad beans, but those are gross because they're supposed to be in, like prepared with other stuff. Not yet, not eight on their own. Pickled beetroot. I don't think I've ever tried beetroot. Same goes for a lot of vegetables and stuff. Salt and vinegar. Potato chips. They're called crisps, Reptiloid. Now who's the American? But yeah, they're, they're one of the best flavours. Go over to Inferno's house and steal them all. More of the ambiguous. Yeah, it's good. Rather than just, hi, I'm evil, I'm going to destroy the world. Oh, no. And they've got good reasons for what they do. Gilgamesh? I don't remember his story. Probably because I haven't played five yet. The broad bean sleeping on a blankety bed? I don't think so, they were just in like a... a tin or something. And then in the microwave, I killed them. And then they tried to kill me. Oh my god! Because they were gross enough that I felt like I was gonna die. Not really, but... Chips in both French, to both French fries and potato chips. We can't be having this. I'm here to kill chaos, and you are it. It's up to you now. You must save my Cassiopeia. Use this one to crush the evil that has enveloped her heart. Displace her mask. Reveal the innocent princess whose face it hides. Can I do that right now? Is she right through there? Why did it get smaller? Doodle do. So you did all this for his daughter? Doodle Doo shrunk into a doodle dip. Doodle Doo asked you to help him, Oliver. Yes, and that's exactly what we're going to do. I've got Astra now, nothing can stop us. You haven't got it yet. Pick it up then. We have to save the White Wi- White Willy. No, we have to save Cassiopeia. They couldn't be asked to animate a pick-up animation. That's rubbish. Maybe it's not, though. Hmm. 
Boing. ATSTs. We're gonna come. You love robots. Extra critical, everything crisps, that'd be better. Fish and crisps. Wow, nipple laser. You haven't even got any nipples. How'd you manage that? Oh, they're actually quite painful. Gildering the lily. Amassing a fortune of half a million guilders. Oh, that came like right at the end. Half a million quid. What a rich bastard I am. I saw that wiggle. Second puffy. Oh no. Pinky. It's not going to be the same. That's like basically a million damage. Die then. Anthropomorphic UFO. Good people caught in bad situations, I guess so. At least he was. Yeah, I guess they all are. There's more dungeon. Oh, okay, we're over here now. Yeah. Wood? What the hell, Reptiloid? I guess that must be a line from the video or something. Is there too? All these spoilers. I can't believe it. That's alright, it's only Poofy. It's not like I would have been like, oh, Poofy's here! Oh, I love it! Sharpie. That's spelt wrong though. Sharp E. Red letter media coin. Oh, that makes sense. It sounds like something they would see. Places forever. At least there's a chesticle over here. This time. I don't know if I wanted that. I guess I do have to do the Grandia Game Boy game. After the experience that was the first game. We're gonna have as much Grandia here as possible. I'm even gonna make a Grandia spin-off game myself. Sue will be the main character. And she has to sit in all the chairs in the world. Polishly. Hi there, get isekai to ground you out from Japan. You're telling me a lot of things that I don't know yet. At least that's right at the start of the game though. I do prefer not to know things, though. That sounds like a very strange idea for a Grandia game, though. I guess it'll make sense when I play it, though. If I play it. Bravery 
Nothing. Maybe there was potentially a tokopi toku over here. Tokopi toko. Is that no? That's a cat. Kill it. No, don't. Dear Infernal. Oh, I've got Angel Cat. Bloin? She can sit on my Iron Throne if you know what I mean. No. Only the grown-up Sue. Astra Astralon. I thought it was as as what was his name? I don't know. The Baldur's Gate three. Astalion. Uh, Astral. Chain. He probably wants to be chained. Astarian. Mm. That bloke. That geezer. Worm thing. I guess I better check all of this stuff. See if it's any good. Resistance to fire. Sure. The griffin's talons. There's some pretty good accuracy, but whatever. And that's just better. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> That's better. Brink man's badge. He's on the brink. Oh, that'll do. Staring on. Always. That's what my eyes are for. Oh, I don't want to fight it. I was having an internal struggle. Come on, you guys. Enemy. I can't run past it, but I should. But the desire to fight won in the end. If I want to do, do Baldur's Gate 3. That would be a weird game to co-op. It's supposed to be pronounced uh, Astarian. Astare. Astare. Just Astare. The, the ion on the end disappears. Oh, I already got Sharpie. Whatever. I thought that was a different one. It looks like magnetism in here. Magnetic waves. Zooping around as they do. I guess it might be fun. What does the other person do in dialogue? Just sit there and complain about all the dialogue options that the main character is choosing. Oh, another capture. What have I done to deserve such an honour? B-Man. 
H man B dude. And so to battle Big Schnoz. Nose. He was the nose hero all along. Right. That wasn't a oh no yeah, there was a patches like in Dark Souls 2. I forget it. One voiced by Peter Seraphoranwararitz. Peter Pheromones. Pate in Pate. Sleep. Oh, I have. Might wake up one day. Get shocked awake. Let's kill that first. I don't want to sleep again. New disguise for patches. Rose's moustache. Oh, Dan Rose's moustache. I was trying to remember if patches had a moustache, but, but I get what you mean now. What do you mean healthy glow? That doesn't seem like something you would have. Okay, though, I guess. There's nothing over here. Oh, I want to fight you, monkey, but I have to. And so Peter. But patches are such classic. I can't believe all these compliments for Dark Souls 2 today coming from Infernal. He even likes one of the characters more. It's a new era. Probably wouldn't want to co op here. Yeah. It would be weird. I mean, D and D in real life is is played co op, so I guess it would work in some way. But I feel like it wouldn't translate well to it as a video game like that in that form, especially being turn based. Like what you just switch who's using, who's inputting commands, depending on whose turn it is. Die. Oh, not again. I've just got to sit here now then. What's the point of having sleep curing items when you can't use them when you're asleep? Dank socks too. Become boxmen. Or salami men. I'd rather be a box man, because at least then things can be put inside me. Salamis can be put inside me, if you know what I mean. Hopefully thick ones though. Salamis are usually quite thin. That must be way forward software. Compliment Dark Souls 2 more. Yeah, that's a good resolution. Well done, Infernal. I like you now. What do you mean now? Oh, sorry. There's a bit of a plonker before. Why am I dead? Try healing us, Esther. Or have you run out of... Oh, you have run out of MP, actually. Turns out this place is a little bit dodgy. Guess I'll heal everyone. Sandra Bullock in the his house. All right, here have have an item. I got enough of them. Wait, that's HP.
What the hell is this fast creature? It's a tiger. Now I didn't need to, so there's probably a save point coming up, but maybe we have to fight one of those robots in a sec. Doing it via the... oops, hang on. Okay. New Lords of the Fallen. Hmm. It's giving you a new... a new respect. For Dark Souls 2. Mention that 10%? Oh, okay, less often. I thought it was going to be more often. That's probably what it's going to end up being, though. I wonder how many new map games they're going to release this year. And how good they're going to be. Hopefully nobody releases anything this year. Are we going to get a second one? Yes. Too many good games came out last year. Don't need any new games coming out this year. Or at least we don't need any new announcements. There's still ones coming out that I want to come out. One for sure. God. Is it just going to be the same again? I guess they're not all the same though. Play shit jank games. Oh, it's JRPG here. The J does not stand for jank. They're going to be masterpieces like Rogue, Rogue, whatever it was called, Rogue Soldier, Rogue Warrior, not Rogue Legacy. Then maybe that's okay. Oh my god, how much of this is left? Probably not a whole lot. Why would I want to come over here just to fight you? Adult nep game, okay, that's worth it. Oh, as, as an adult, never mind. I mean, preferably she'd be an adult in an adult game as well. Milf nep. Can you stop using big attacks on us, please? That's rather painful. You're supposed to die easily, like in the past. Boing! Oh yeah, Pragmata. A game that I don't even know anything about other than space. SPICE! Spice Girls. Place your bits of Shadow of the Earth Tree this year. Nah. I reckon, unfortunately, not. It'd be nice, though. I don't know, maybe late in the year. Where would they reveal it? We can do this. Maybe E3, when is that? Like, August? I don't know if there's any other big game shows before E3. Well, I mean, not E3. That's the point. Without E3, it could come any time of the year, so never mind. Wasn't there some replacement for E3 now, though? Actually. Another one by the Doritos Pope. As people call him. Welcome back, Castus. A nap? I can't believe it. This game's boring to you. But we're just in the final dungeon here. Dungeon ear. Did somebody call me? No, fuck off. I probably just sound like an insane person every time I do the almighty ear bit. Anyone who's not familiar with the uh, the masterpiece that is Virus Bloke 1.
chomp. Still generations old. Oh, that's okay then. I don't know why I'm fighting it. And so to battle. Here goes. I hope you had a good, a good nap. I need one clearly. Oh, looks like this is going to end up being a six hour error. Maybe. A famous victory. I'm up for it though. Probably going to have to piss at some point and refill the water. Reverse. Nep reverse. When she turns around and shows her ass instead of her face. Yum! Especially gonna have to refill it and, and pee if you make me keep drinking. Mm. Angie. Calm fuck. As in the fuck. Sorcerer's soul, I don't know what that was, it's probably a weapon or something. <laughs> He's heaving one out, you can tell. Parents listening in. Let them be worried. It's not their concern. Dragon penis. There, that'll stop them listening. Water. Grab it while it's hot. Ooh. Remake of Highway Dimension. I don't know why I'm chasing it. Stop it. I don't want to fight anymore. I turned over a new peaceful leaf. She got all that MP, yummy. Loads of it. A remake of a remake. I think they were out of ideas with the first game. They just kept remaking the same game over and over to, for, for 10 games or whatever. No, I don't know how many there are. Idea Factory, the Kings of Mediocre. I've only played like probably too much of the first one and it did get quite boring but I guess it's like a wizard secret it's probably a decent enough ah mega elixir like just light-hearted thing to switch your brain off for I guess if you just want some waifu bait Objectively the worst. I guess that makes sense. The training wheels game. Then after that they knew where to improve. Whip whip, bye. Oh my god, I avoided an enemy. I can't believe it. Whenever East Nordics comes out, I'm gonna play a no fighting enemies run. Rawr. Sparks, hi. Sometimes I manage to remember to check the names of who's redeeming things, and sometimes I realise that it's a good thing to do. I wonder how many people have redeemed things without me realising they're here. Because they use the sounds to, to make themselves known. But how I we're in the final dungeon here. But that's alright. I might still be going for another hour. <clears throat> Let's go! I've set myself in for a finishing the game today. Unless we get thrown into some kind of new world, which I wouldn't put it past the game at this point. With the jape they did. But good to see you. You're here to hopefully see the final battle. 
Wait, we're getting drops of those things from the casino. Right, there were new things to uh, redeem in the casino. I need to go back and check that too if I get a chance. What if there's cool stuff? Excessively long story, grand repetitive dungeons. A gimmick in the combat, which you either like or get on with. I don't remember a gimmick, if we're still talking about the first game. Only thing I remember... Oh, the uh... It had some kind of combo stuff, didn't it? I think I enjoyed the combat well enough. I like that you can kind of move freely and try and line up the attacks to hit as many enemies as possible, if I remember right. Because it, like, shows you the area of effect of them. Which was kind of nice. 50 bucks for anime girls. Oh, the music's buggered off. This might be it. Uh, even if I get to leave the dungeon, I probably won't be able to walk back into this point. So I don't really want to. Right, here we go, hopefully. Final boss. Better be lots of voice acting. I've earned it. Jeevers, you are late, Oliver. So you're. Behold the overseers of the world's fate. The Zodiacs. Do I have to fight all of them? So you shared a soul with the Dark Jinn. Know then that this world made him what he was. His despair was born of its rank imperfection. Just a group of random kids I showing up at your door. Bring this world to an end. He failed. But I shall not. And two adults. And yet you would have us believe that this is a world worth saving. Probably not, actually, to be honest. I very much like to hear you argue that case. The side quests are boring. Tell us what the world is worth. Come, boy. Let us hear what you have to say. You come first. What the hell? Hmm. What was that evil laugh? It's okay, Pete. It's all gonna be okay. Ta -da. This world is full of people doing their best to live their lives. Full of people. It's their world, and I won't let you destroy it. What a badass. Bold words for a brat like you to utter. <laughs> This is the child the prophecies speak of. The Gallus would betray us for one so We are the Counts of Greece. Our decisions determine the fate of the world. I don't remember if a vow looked interesting to me. I forgot what it was. You're wrong. You're alone, Cassiopeia. You always have been. Oh! Gone. I just defeated 12 bosses. Oh, and her, just by with saying that alone. Are you right? My words are so powerful. It was something Gala said. He said she was locked inside her own world. You mean to say that entire council was a figment of her imagination? Her magic was so strong, it turned her thoughts into reality. Why? Hold on a second. I wish I could do that. made the White Witch disappear? Was she an illusion too? No, the White Witch is real. The final boss never existed. And she's in there. After another hour of dungeon. Here we go. I'm gonna spank her. Majorly. Oh god. What a needless waste of materials that we used to make this place. You could have put this floor to better use in a new Unreal game. Never mind, the reflection's gone now, I don't want it anymore. So this is the White Witch's house, eh? Bit posh, isn't it? Good place for a final showdown, though. Proper epic. Yeah, I guess I just wish we didn't have to fight. I mean, yeah, I guess. I wish we did. I just wish we didn't have to fight, but we can't let Cassiopeia destroy the world again. And maybe we can still save her. Open the door to the throne room. Right, let's try this cutscene thing. How dare you? Cutscene thing again. What? So? Did you not hear me? 
Be gone from here. I did hear you. You didn't say that. That is enough. Oh, you As you have no doubt disintegrated him. Apis was but another phantom created by my memory. Yes. Another illusion. Yes. How long has it been, P? <gasps> Not long enough. How long since? Cassiopeia! Why? Why do you have to destroy the world? Because it is imperfect. Imperfect like the human heart. Long ago, my own was consumed by the blackest despair. But then I discovered something on the furthest shores of solitude. I found true strength. Strength enough to remake the world. But you didn't have to flipping go and use it, did you? He's right. You're not did the have only to. person in the world. No point having the power the if you're not gonna use it. Exactly how you want it, but that's no reason to just get rid of everyone. You didn't you get rid of them, that. turned them into zombies. It's wrong! It's wrong! It's wrong! Silence! Fuck you, know, calm down! The world is mine to remake as I see fit! And none shall defy my will! Weak hearted humans! I condemn you to suffer! We already forever. have. Oh, we haven't done forever. It's felt like forever sometimes. Oh. Think up a nuclear bomb, that would be handy. I've pretty much got nuclear bomb power here. I don't know if she's floating towards me menacingly. Hi, Takeshi. Sneak attack, just like solid sneak. Rubbish, I thought she was going to be weak to it. She's already half dead, no? I hope you are well today. Flip it heck, I can feel the White Witch's power from over by here, man. Make sure you dodge her spells, Ollie Boy, or block them or something. Okay, I've been playing this game long enough now, Drippy. Thanks, though. Well, I defended, but I don't know if they did. Apparently not. Well, apparently I didn't either. Very well. Do I have to defend against this as well? Yes. Much o pain. Oops. They were still um, defending and stuff. Nice! I am going to use... Yeah, sure. Just real quick. It does a farty noise when she uses magic. Okay, that's not too concerning. Now she's literally half dead. Is that defend worthy? It would have been. Sorry for missing stuff. Oh, that's just defense. Wait, is it? I don't know what it is. Of darkness. I don't think that was anything, was it? No, kind of is. Not too much damage though. That's the one, but I knocked her out of it, so that's okay. Was that it? A Praganti lightning. I hope so. Just no. As the Very well. oh, great. Whoa. Huh? Been creeping. Look. What a perv. Oh, I've got a bad feeling about this. That's all right. I'll just smack her. Changing. Oh, she did go super sane, kind of. She's got Cassiopeia. yellow on her now. You can't destroy the world. I won't let you. She looks like a boss from Elden Ring. I'm glad you argued.